Hello everyone, it's me Pete Air, the founder of Hit The Beat and the founder of Breakletics. And today I decided to tell you the truth. I want to tell you more about my thoughts, about my feelings, about the idea behind Hit The Beat and Breakletics because years and years over and over I'm just posting high quality videos, exercises, but actually I don't talk about my feelings and about my thoughts. I want to tell you everything about the history, how I started, why I started, what happens in the last 10 years um, about my partnerships with Adidas, with Bull, meeting with Nike, how I went through depression, bad times, good times, about business, life lessons. And because today we reached 15,000 followers on YouTube, I want to start with a reaction video um, with my first video I posted on YouTube about fitness. Short story, before I'm going to show you the video, I was dancing, breaking for more than 20 years. I started when I was 14, then I studied sport economics. I realized how boring the fitness world is. Monotonous exercises, no crazy variations, always the same. And in breaking, the most important thing is to be individual, to be creative, to be different than other people. And now when we check this video, I tried to put already the philosophy behind breaking into this video. When I released this video, the name Breakletics did not exist yet. So I did not know what's going to happen when I put this video online. I did not know that Breakletics or Hit The Beat were going to be created so crazy crazy with this video that i'm going to show you right now i just wanted to become more famous to show my skills and now let's check like you see 13 years ago this was my first viral video back in the days on youtube um, cool comments also fun story in the beginning everyone liked it from the b-boy scene i just get positive feedback but then when i had this business idea to make like some money out of it um, and stuff like that i got so much hate i was almost stopping this vision and this idea what i had the vision to show the people what the body is capable of that uh, strong mind and a, and a strong soul needs a strong body to experience these beautiful things in this world and that your body can do more than just squats, planks, push-ups. But now let's check the video. Let's go. And the song, what you, what you are going to hear is from Karate Tiger. <laughs> I was inspired by this movie. That's why I use this song. And let's talk about some different exercises. So the first one, pretty hard but yeah this base is nothing new so this was like a basic exercise but it's very difficult um, to do but i just like the form i like the idea to push all your body up and and maybe one other thing the location is in herne uh, i was born in poland but i lived in herne for about yeah, 18 years and this is a dance school port Purus, where i often went to um, training breaking some of my trailers like too hard to bite. <laughs> For example, I recorded some videos with Lil Amok. Next exercise. Like this exercise, when I did this, I never saw this exercise 13 years ago with such a quality. Like you see, it's perfect. I like when fitness or breaking moves has a great aesthetic, sharp lines, that if you want to that each movement when you want to make a, a picture looks amazing and like you can see here it's like perfect well shaped and yeah this exercise is also pretty hard <laughs> like almost every exercise in this video let's go for the next one yeah this um is like um yeah a gymnastic exercise and um, what i also um, did quite a lot of times to improve my flair, so to improve my power moves in breaking. This is also very hard because you're getting cramps <laughs> in your uh, leg muscles. Yes. 
Yeah, the next one is um, nothing special. You throw your body from one side to your other one, but also a great exercise to um, yeah, improve your skills. And then the next exercise, this is, in my opinion, um, of course, maybe some other people say some different things, but I also, when I'm going to tell the story, I will invite a lot of people that were here in this movement from the very beginning, everyone, 13 years ago, 10 years ago. So I will invite a lot of people that are going to talk about their story and what they think about breakletics and hit the beat. And this exercise is really um, inspired by breaking by a flare where the legs come close to your mm, head. And from the flare, you jump out again on your feet. And this is the same movement like you see now when you put your body together it's the same maybe i can put a picture right here also when you do the flare and the legs are beside your head so this is inspired by the i call it sandwich flare also a great exercise for mobility and explosiveness yeah one of my favorite ones one of my favorite ones and this one is just a combination of a regular flare and uh, a push-up. It's cool, nothing that special. Yeah, but always fancy. People like this move and me too. <laughs> yeah, let's go to the next one. Yeah, this one is just hard. Um, I'm not sure if somebody did this exercise already before, but like I told you, I love to have this pictures like now where you have both hands like wings i have also a great picture um what i did because i'm sometimes i'm creating movements out of pictures and here is an example yeah and this of course is karate tiger style <laughs> inspired by the movie um to show the that i can do a split and then a one-handed push up with the split also it's cool it's fancy um, it's difficult you need a good mobility a good stretch and when you have this scene and you hear the music then you have then you can imagine that i have a good con connection to this movie karate tiger <laughs> i even don't know if it's the same name in uh, english this exercise make no sense <laughs> it just hurts of course, there are also some movements in breaking where you do uh, breaking moves like that. I did like a flare like that in the tour to bite trailer or a head spin and then I put myself up on my on the other side of the hands. But this make don't do that at home. <laughs> it just hurts. Yeah, and this also like an exercise to get a good flare, a good power move um, in breaking. And here I get so many cramps in my um, muscles all the time. Yeah, but again, it looks amazing. And here, this is like an X-Men push-up, also inspired by breaking. Um, I love that one. Like you see here again, when you make a picture here, it looks dope, it looks cool. And I did a lot of breaking moves like that um, with cross hands. This is like more, uh, Basic also, but here again, like you see, great aesthetics. I like when you have these lines, when you can make this kind of sharp lines and that is such a great aesthetic. Yeah, but that's not so hard. Yeah, this is an X-Men balance, <laughs> um, also inspired by breaking. I think it's one of the hardest handstand that exists in this world. If you want, you can try to do stuff like that, cross your hands like that, and then try to make a handset like that. At the same time, you have no balance because you can not um, yeah, use the hand on the floor like normally when people do one arm handstands, because when you are like that, you have so much pressure on the hand, like you see, you can't move. So it's really an exercise where you have to use like an, untold uh, technique <laughs> it's really difficult for me to explain how i'm even able to stand like that but you need a lot of strength for this movement 
Yeah, and this is like air flare push-ups. If you know the air flare in breaking, mm, then it's inspired by air flare, where you twist your body 360 degrees and always land on the hands. So my legs are on the floor, but the real air flare, there you have this, the legs in the air. Then, in my opinion, again, I think I was the first one in the world that did this push-ups. The name is scissor push-ups, um, also inspired by some breaking movements, not a yeah, particular movement. I'm even not sure how the name is in breaking, where you have like the six step and then you do like a 360 with the leg. Maybe I'm going to find it and show it here. And yeah, this is like also 100% inspired by breaking. Let's go to the next one. Yeah, this one um, looks fancy, looks hard maybe, but it's very, very easy. In general, I always like to do this slide movements, to do the slides. Yes. Yeah, this is a basic push-up, some kind of archer push-up combination, combinations. Yeah, and this, yeah. <laughs> a girl on my back while I'm doing push-ups. <laughs> So this was the story behind this cool dope video, my first video that went viral on YouTube. What I can tell you, I had just the vision that a lot of people are going to click on it, get inspired and a lot of people did. They liked. After this video, a lot of things changed in my career. The, call, the people called me, hey, king of push-ups, let's make some push-ups. So I already influenced a lot of b-boys and some other people like parkour. So more the urban um, way of working out. And I got a lot of like people that copy this video, <laughs> make like a revival video where they did exactly the same exercises and get inspired. So that's, that's the story behind this video. After this, like I told you, a lot of things changed, but I don't want to tell you too much. Um, the next video I'm going to post will be the second video um, that I post. And there I had already the idea to call it Breakletics. Like I told you in the beginning in this video, um, I did not know that Breakletics or even Hit the Beat is going to exist one day. I hope you like this little story behind this video. Stay tuned if you want to train like me. Follow this movement. Check the link in the description. <laughs> of course, the moves are not that hard anymore. <laughs> That's way easier. The fitness concept is adapted to fitness levels for all different fitness levels because for me it was very important or is very important to um, have a movement, a philosophy that almost everyone in this world can try to unleash their full potential, to um, work on its, his body awareness, um, to get stronger, to get fitter. And if you even want to become an instructor, we have instructors all around the world already. Um, be part of this movement, join this community. Thumbs up if you like this video. Comment your thoughts under the video and yeah stay tuned peace peter five six seven eight